And now the night everyone in the football world has been longing for. Millions will be watching around the world. It is, of course, the biggest final in club football, the UEFA Champions League final. Welcome to the commentary box. Derek Ray here, joined by Stuart Robson. It is Manchester City taking on Real Madrid. Well, Derek, it doesn't come any better than this, does it? This has the makings of an absolute classic. These are two brilliant teams, and at the moment, I can't separate them. And a look at the starting 11 for Manchester City. Ederson gets the nod in goal. Rodri plays alongside Kevin De Bruyne in the centre of the park. And lining up through the middle in attack today, Erling Haaland. And the starting players for Real Madrid. Antonio Rudiger plays alongside Nacho Fernandez in central defence. Toni Kroos plays alongside Federico Valverde. My goodness, that save! Fully stretched he was. One for his own highlights reel. Corner kick delivery from Toni Kroos. Real Madrid get the throw in. Well, possibilities inside the box. Oh, a superb save! And still dangerous. Well, threat averted. Silva. Well, it's always a great thrill to watch Erling Haaland in action. He can be absolutely unstoppable, and we should expect that he'll have a prominent role to play in this one, Stuart. Well, he comes alive around the box. He's so good at backing into defenders, rolling away from them, and then getting off his shots quickly. He's so difficult to mark, and that's why he's their leading goal scorer. Erling Haaland. Grealish. On to Silva. Right in strongly to win the ball. Promising pass. It is a decent looking attack here. Force. And a crucial intervention inside the box. Holland. Grealish, still on level terms, moving the ball nicely. That was going in! Set pieces can be so important, let's see what City have been working on. De Bruyne, it was on its way in! Guardiol, and Bernardo Silva has it. Well, when all was said and done, Stuart, he wasn't a million miles away. No, he wasn't, because he generates so much power from that sort of distance. His technique is brilliant. Federico Valverde. And now Rodrigo. Aurelien Chouameni. Valverde. Outdoing his opponent. Oh, how about that for a tackle? Well, there we have it. We're at the halfway mark. Well, underway once more, and it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in the second half. Bad challenge, and now it's up to the referee in terms of what to do next. A oh, good vision there. Sound piece of goalkeeping. Rodri. On to Holland. Jude Bellingham. Really fine piece of defending play to break us up. Kevin De Bruyne. Phil Foden now. Attacking possibilities for Real. Huge block. Walker. Rodri. 
and into the last 30 minutes now passing it around looking for the goal that would put them ahead Tony Kroos and now Rodrigo and the textbook interception Holland defensive Brazilians to shut them down well doesn't have to do it on his own and Bellingham and a foul in the opinion of the referee now what can they do from this free kick situation nothing wrong with the idea on the free kick but the goalkeeper has it corner kick played in and taking care of the situation Holland Phil Foden now City finding space on the flank trying to get onto the front foot with the minutes ticking away now the cross was deep, a little too deep not messing around with that clearance Long way out, this. Well, the keeper kept it out with a minimum of fuss, but it wasn't a great effort. Vinicius Junior and Bellingham. And so into the final five minutes. That's effective pressure high up the pitch. Aurelia Chouameni. That is that after 90 minutes. They are level and extra time is coming up. So back in business here, the first period of extra time and it might well come down to mental fortitude. Who wants this more? And City being afforded too much room. Options in the middle. And Cross gets in the way of the cross. The referee spotted the little nick on the way through. So a throw in coming up. Is it going to be? Well, that's really sound goalkeeping, not letting the opposition have any scraps. And City recovering possession well. There will be one minute added on at the end. Half time in extra time and still. And away they go again. Second period of extra time has commenced. He's protecting it effectively. And level it is, in the closing moments, can Real Madrid change that? Well, good effect of pressure. Holland. Kevin De Bruyne couldn't keep the ball. Oh, breezing past him. Angles it back. Locking in. With time running out, a corner to Real Madrid. And there's the delivery. And still danger here. No nonsense clearance. 
After 120 minutes, they can't... And now it is all about the penalty shootout. And it's gone in. Can he convert? So lethal in front of goal. I must say, that takes real confidence. Brilliant. Well, he fired it straight down the middle. And he steps up to take the shot. Clinical, as always, in front of goal. And he finds the net. He could hardly miss. Composure is so important under these trying circumstances. Goalkeeper beaten from the spot. And the penalty converted here. Mental preparation is such a big part of this. In it goes. And so the tension levels have been ratcheted up to full blast. And he's beaten the keeper. And he steps up to take his penalty. And he scores! Job done from the spot. And up he comes, doing his best to remain focused. He had to score, and he does. and confidently converted well it's all about keeping a cool head and there it is perfectly executed and it's gone in can he keep us cool and he's denied them from the spot and now a heaven-sent opportunity to win the match. And there it is! That brings it to a conclusion and a contrast in emotions. One team joyful, the other absolutely devastated. Well, what drama, what scenes and what a good finish to this game. It really has been exhilarating. Well, in football, you don't forget these moments in a hurry. Due reward for their persistence and their overall excellence. Well, it really has been engrossing today. Such a tight game, but you have to feel sorry for the losers. They were so close, but yet so far away. And the party mood has enveloped the stadium. It's going to be quite the night of celebration here.